Okay. Okay, I'm going to try this again because my camera keeps dying because I haven't used it and the battery is dead as bad words. Hi guys, Babe Mitchie here. Anyways, um, I wanted to give you guys a heads up as to what's going on in my life. I'm tired. I'm always tired. I'm so tired that um, I haven't been making videos. I want to make videos. I have a million ideas for, for videos, but I, I just, I can't do it. I don't have the time. So, what's going on in my life? Okay, first of all, right now, Labyrinth. That's right, check it out, what's up? Bought it at Kohl's. Kohl's has some cool t-shirts. So does Walmart, but meh. Um, also wearing my uh, Assurance brand diapers. Remember I did the 100 layers challenge? Um, and I, I told you guys, I'm not going to waste these diapers, right? I meant that, okay? I really did mean that. Um, I'm wearing three of them. Because you can't just wear one of these things and, and hope that it's going to uh, uh, work for you. If, if you wear one Assurance brand diaper, um, you're going to leak right through it and you will regret your... You will, you will regret it, okay? Um, and the trick is to cut, um, just, just rip that whole thing open. So th there's actually three diapers on right now. Um, and my tip would be, I mean, you can go four, you can go five, whatever you want to do. I don't even care. You can go 100. Actually, we've proven that that's an issue. Um, I actually, maybe, maybe one day I'll get Jesse to come on over. I'll be like, yo, Jesse, uh, this time you need to come over, uh, help me put on 100 diapers. And we'll do it the real way, all the way down. It'll be like a mummy. Like, I'm wearing a hundred layers of diapers! That's what it would be like if, uh, but I would need help. Um, and people have talked about that, and I'm sorry, there's bugs floating around because I cracked open a beer. Yeah! Beer, baby! An alcoholic! Um, and that's just me being stupid. Um, I'm actually having a little bit of time for myself for once, guys, so I'm, I'm being a little crazy and, and, and trying to, like, tomorrow... tomorrow. All right. Anyways, we'll get there. We'll get there. Let's start at the beginning here of everything. Why have I not been making videos? I haven't been making videos because I'm working two jobs right now. I work at a chocolate factory. I'm currently making 1880 per hour. Um, my goal, actually, I want to make videos for a living. That's what I want to do. I want to be an actor. Um, but I don't want to go to school. I mean, I would, I'd be willing to take classes, but it's like, I just want a director or a producer to be like, I want you in our movie, you know, and be like, oh, I'll be like, whatever you want. You know what I mean? I'll do it. But that aside, all that aside, um, right now I'm doing what I have to do. I'm working at the factory. All right. I'm, the, I'm an Oompa Loompa. All right. I'm making chocolate for 18, 80 an hour. Um, I would rather be making 25 to 30. I've, I've already factored in my life goals and how much I need to make to, to have the lifestyle that I want. And that would be $25 an hour to $30 an hour. I know there's people out there who are like, you're making 18, 18 hour. Damn. Well, that's not enough money. And I can tell you it's not enough money because I'm working two jobs. So I'm working full time at two jobs. That's right. So, if you're like, why isn't Mitch making videos? Mitch isn't making videos because baby Mitchie's busy right now, working and sleeping. That's all I do. All I do is work and sleep and work and sleep. So, to all the people that think, oh, adult babies are a bunch of losers and all they want to do, and then they're like, oh, that baby Mitchie guy is always asking for donations. Well, I ask for donations simply because when I'm on my computer and I'm, I'm doing a video, and I'm doing video editing and all this and that, blah, blah, blah. And you, all this crap you guys don't realize happens. At least you might not. Um, it, takes, it takes time and effort. I'm more than willing to do it, okay? I like to do it. Um, but I don't make any money on it. It's just time that just goes, push -hoo. And uh, as much as I like to do it, I, I, w I would like to also make money while doing it. And I, I don't think that's too much to ask. Um, so that's why I've asked for donations in the past. And I'm not saying, oh, donate now. You can. It's on my PayPal. It's on my... You can find out if you want to donate money. And it's actually... You can. But, um, 
No, no, please. Actually, don't donate to me. All right? You hear me? Don't donate, ever. Uh, my point is, though, that people are always, um, you know, oh, baby, adult babies are a bunch of losers. They don't, they don't work. Get a job and, and this and that. Don't, how dare you ask for donations and like, and like, get a job. Well, I have two of them. How's that? Isn't that enough? <sighs> okay. So anyways, uh, the point is I'm working two jobs that are full time. Uh, I work a factory job. I'm great. Um, right now I'm refining chocolate. So if you want to look up chocolate refining, that's what I do. Um, not that I don't know more than that because there's a whole lot of stuff that we do, but, um, I do that. Um, and I'm damn good at my job. You know, I know how to do my job. What can I say? Um, I'm a factory worker, you know what I mean? Like a company man. Um, so like, and I, I'm not proud of that. I'm not proud of that. Um, my dad was a company man and I've become a company man. You know, the kind of guy that comes in and they do their job and then the factory goes under and you lose your job and then you kill yourself because life sucks and you have no money. Um, no, I'm serious. That's what happens. Like a factory, if you're a factory man or a, a you know, this is just, it's not good. It's not where I want to be. Um, but I am, I'm proud of being good at what I do. Um, I'm also an assistant manager of a store. Could I be the store manager? Yes. But here's the problem. Um, I make more money at the factory than the store manager makes. Yeah. I'm not kidding. I'm not even kidding. No jokes. No, no lies. Um, so there's actually no reason for me to ever become a store manager unless the factory would go under. And I don't think my uh, assistant manager position at the store is going to last very long. I mean, it, I've been doing it for five months. But um, I, I, it's killing me. It's, it's basically a slow death. It's, 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 I'm, I'm dying. Um, because I work full-time, two jobs. And like I said earlier, I was jumping around. But tomorrow, I will be at the store for 13 and a half hours. Okay, you hear me? 13 and a half hours. And um, then I'll be going to the factory to work for eight hours. Um, and if I'm not incorrect, that's 21 and a half hours. I, I'm just shooting that off the top of my head. I might be wrong. 21 and a half hours, let's just, just say that's that. Then there's like two hours of driving time in there. So I'm gonna be basically working for almost 24 hours. And that's my life right now. So to all the people that say adult babies, uh, bleh, babies don't uh, have jobs and don't work, well, let me tell you something. You're wrong! And you make me grumpy and angry. Yeah. So, why am I working two jobs? <sighs> I bought a house. That's right. Did you notice anything a little bit different? Not this, I'm not talking about this. I'm talking about different. Um, there's no video games over here. Okay, there's actually crap over here, but there's not much in here because I'm in the middle of moving right now. Um, I, 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 I don't even know. Like, I, I'm working 21 hours and I'm, and I'm moving to a new house. I, I, I don't even know how I'm doing it. How, I mean, what, what uh, I'm going to lose my mind before you know it. I'm going to be like, Pickles! 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 That's it. That's all it's going to be left is freaking vegetables. Like pickles. I mean, that's it. <sighs> so what's, what's the future hold, right? That's the real question here. You know, is, is this life now? No. I'm not going to work two jobs for the rest of my life. Am I ever going to be a rich and famous actor? No, most likely not. It's, it's kind of funny because on the grand scheme of things, as I rate them, um, even the uh, Prancer Size lady, look it up on YouTube, Prancer Size. She's done better than me. Somehow. Don't know how but she's done better. 
Um, I'm a little salty about that one. I'm sorry. I'm salty. But, um, it is what it is. So right now I'm cutting loose because tomorrow is going to be hell on earth for me. Not every day is this bad, okay? Not, not every day is this bad, but I, I literally work every day. In the last five months, I've had three days off, okay? Five months, three days off. And what I mean by a day off is, is literally a day in which I probably got done at 7.30 in the morning at my other job, and then I had off that whole day and that, that night, and then the next day I had to work. That's what I mean by a day off. <laughs> so it's not even like, it's not even like a true day off, but that's what I'm trying to say. Like that's three of them in five months and that's what they were. It sucks. It's bad. Um, my camera's dead. It's hooked up like crap. There's, I just throw up a light. I, I don't have this hooked up. I'm not, my computer, I have a RAID set up. It crashed. I reinstalled Windows because I was just done with that crap. I, up, I, up, I upgraded a whole lot of stuff, okay? I have money. You know, I'm working two jobs. I've got money. Um, you know, people need money. I, I make it rain, okay? Um, the money's there. I fixed all my debt, my credits. My, I, 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 I got money, okay? Money's not really... I mean, it, it is an issue. I wish that I made money making videos, but, but that, that's besides the point. You know, it's, it's not the issue. The issue is time and money. Time. Time. All I need is time. Um... And when I get some more time, when my other job ends, there will be a uh, baby makes you come back. Okay, it's gonna come. It's gonna. It's it's. I, I, that didn't come out right. Um, it's gonna happen. There will be a baby makes you come back. It's gonna happen. Okay, um, and it's gonna be several videos. And I've already hinted on Facebook just now. It's gonna be harder. It's gonna be better. It's gonna be faster and stronger. And it's going to be multiple videos. It's going to be so good that you're going to you're going to want to watch it one more time. It's going to be multiple videos because we're going to tell a whole story. Um, there's going to be a lot of costumes and makeup involved, and a lot of stuff. And I've already told you more than I should, um, but uh, that's just to give you a hint of what's to come. I'm actually going to plan more than that. I, I have a Halloween thing. I. I need to try to get this reboot of my channel done so that I can catch Halloween again because I have a plan for Halloween as well and it's going to be difficult to, to do it. But um, I'll be in my house at the end of this week and, and, and things are going to get moving hopefully. So hopefully more Baby Mitchie videos are coming. Um, so that's uh, that's really just what I wanted to get out there, guys, is that I'm I'm going through hell right now. I'm just tired all the time. I'm, I went through so much crap with, with my cat Milo dying. It, it, it broke my heart, you know? And he's he's right over there. He's in his box, and I'm not lifting up because your, 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 your cat should never fit inside of a box. And this is, uh, this is to Milo. And, uh, and Salem. Um, um. I'm sorry. It's, um... I hate to be one of those people that's, like, talking about their dead pets. Um, I don't have my own child, and uh, I know I know that that probably uh, can can really hit some people on the end, like, a, a weird nerve, because, like, oh, I've got a baby, I'm a grown man, one diaper, gonna have a baby. Well, I, I would be a wonderful father. I don't care what you think. Okay, my kid is going to know all about all the old stuff that I used to love. And it's not diapers, okay? It's, it's freaking Mega Man and, and Mario and, and Sonic the Hedgehog, you know, like Commodore 64, you know. My, my, it, it, I would nerd the hell out of my kid is what I'm trying to say, unless they didn't appreciate it. I'm not going to force anything on my child, of course. Um, but ch children u uh, usually like to emulate their parents, so I would like to think that um, if I finally did have a baby, that that's what would happen. Um, but who knows? That's 
I never thought I'd buy a house, and I bought a house, and that's something. We got a full-size attic. We have a seven-foot-high ceiling basement, okay? The basement is going to house the green screen. I'm going to have people over. We're going to... There's going to be a big, huge recording. There's equipment involved, and I'm purchasing... Um, I'm, I'm putting... I'm, I'm, I'm putting thousands of dollars into my remaking of videos. It's, it's going to happen. It's going to be expensive. It's, it's, it's like, I, I'm not, I'm not kidding. I'm going to put thousands of dollars into making videos that make me no money. And I'm not complaining about that at all, guys. I'm not, I'm not. I mean, it sounds like I am. I'm just, I'm just, I just want you to know how much it means to me that you're there and you watch the videos and you enjoy them and that you realize how much goes into it. Okay. Um, recently I started vaping, which it, I'm not proud of either. Um, I was watching my friend vape and I was like, oh man, I want to start vaping. It looks like it really relaxes you. And I, I think it kind of does relax you, but it's just a stupid addiction. You know, it's, it is, it's just a stupid addiction. And, um, my promise to myself is that when I, um, I'm not a smoker either. I don't smoke. I would never smoke. A cigarette or a cigar or anything like that burns um, my you know is that I'm gonna stop vaping when um, when I'm no longer working two jobs uh, because it's it's not good it's I'm just I'm so stressed out all the time and the thought would be well just wear diapers well I can't okay I'm always working and then I'm always sleeping and to be honest I don't sleep as well in a diaper usually and that's just being brutally honest. I mean, it would have to be ice cold for me to be feel, feel comfortable in a diaper in my sleep. Um, it, it feels comfortable in my head, but then bringing that into reality, that it's kind of two different things, okay? Does that make sense? I don't know if anyone can relate to me or not, but in my head, it's like you put a diaper on, you snuggle up with your, te your teddy bear, or my, in my case, a fox, and, you know, it's just like, mm, you know, and you feel a little and stuff, and it, it feels good, it does. But uh, sometimes the heat and the temperature and, and, and stuff, it's just, it's not always a good situation there, so. Just being brutally honest with you guys, okay? Brutally honest. Um, and I'm jumping around like crazy. Uh, you know, lately I've been on, like, so many weird things. You know, just get this off my chest. Whenever someone uh, famous dies, it, it always ha hits, it hits a chord with me because... In my own mind, I am famous, and I'm not famous, okay? I'm nothing. I am a nobody. I am zero zip zilch. Uh, I'm basically dog crap. Um, but when, like, and this is not recent either, by the way. Um, but, I mean, Robin Williams dying, I was like, if a guy like Robin Williams can't handle it, what hope is there for the rest of us? And, um, I mean, that's always my reaction, you know? David Bowie dying, you know, like, he, he's one of those people that was, like, like for Labyrinth thing, and it's just, like, it, not just that, but other things that he did, you know, like his music. Uh, it's just, like, wow. Prince, not so much. I have nothing against him. Um, uh, and the, uh, oh, God, uh, you know, Snape from Harry Potter, that was, you know, not so much, but I did care. And then recently... I'm looking back in the past with this one to my childhood. I'm looking at Christopher Reeves, and if you don't know who he is, it's Superman, and he, you know, he fell off his, his horse because it just abruptly stopped and it, it paralyzed him as a quadriplegic. So Superman, the Superman that was my childhood Superman, couldn't walk or, or move. You know, like, it's just like... I relate to these people because, like, I look at him. See where I'm going? Give me a second to see where I'm going with this. All right, guys, hang on. He was stuck in his wheelchair. You know, no control of his bowels or or anything, and um, you know, he he he, he had to. He actually had to say, "Wait, I'm, maybe we should just let me go," you know. And Robin Williams came in because they were friends from Juilliard. Why don't I have any famous friends? Um, you know, he came in, this is, this is, this is, this is so Robin Williams. I'm not making this up. This is, you can find us out on the internet. So Christopher Reeves, Superman, is there after his just, just life-changing, just life-destroying accident. 
And he's lying there in his deathbed, so to say. Okay, not his deathbed, but, you know. Um, Robin Williams comes in. Psh, psh. I'm your proctologist. I'm here for your proctology. You know, for your checkup, uh, Christopher Reeves. And he walks in. You, oh, couldn't you see that? He, 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 uh, and, and Christopher Reeves is just like, am I hallucinating? I mean, because, you know, you hallucinate, right? And he's like, Robin Williams! You know, like, imagine how awesome, like, it's just, that point was when he said, I'm going to keep going. You know, he said, I'm not going to give up. I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep moving forward no matter how, how hard things get, okay? And now we're finally coming to my point, um, you know, that uh, I'm not going to give up no matter how hard things get. No matter how hard it is to keep going. So, I have the ideas. Um, the videos are there. They're all in my head. Um, the jokes are there. The, 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 the scenes are there. The shots are there. The concepts are there. It's all there. I just need the time to start filming them. But because I'm working two jobs, I don't have time. So, it's been five months of nothing, and I want to tell you to just hang on, because there are some more videos coming. There will be a comeback soon, when I can do it, when I can make it happen. And that's about it. And again, to just reassure everybody that the assurance diapers aren't being wasted. Well, all diapers are being wasted if you think about it. But uh, they aren't being wasted, they will be used, and again, you need to use a couple at a time, and I recommend that you cut a slit in the diaper. Uh, I actually would recommend that you can actually cut it or you can pull it. Um, you know, we could do a diaper how-to maybe some of these, one of these days. Uh, we'll actually talk about that, it would make more sense to do it then, wouldn't it? Um, so that's it guys, I'm gonna head out, I'm just like, I'm just exhausted. Okay, that's, I, I, I'm just, I'm glad to finally have a second to film something for you guys, to, to say hello and tell you what's going on. The, the, this audio is not hooked up because, you know, like, the computer and, and programs and issues. My camera was a dead battery that wouldn't even record. I just flipped on my light that's way too bright. Um, so, give me some time. When I do come back... It'll be, it'll be harder, better, faster, stronger. Trust me on this. All right, bye.